with mochi donuts if you guys don't know a mochi dough just opened right like next to the studio so i got the taro flavor mm. oh it tastes more like funnel cakey than like other mochi donuts i've had Okay guys, back from ballet. <laughs> I'm so tired now. Um, I'm just gonna do my makeup. There's so many new people in the company. I was looking at the, cause they updated their website. So I was looking. There was some people that left that I didn't think were leaving. <laughs> I don't really know what I'm gonna do today. I am feeling really tired right now because I just took ballet and I'm like not used to it. I don't know. I might, my boyfriend's gonna like walk some dogs. So I'll probably just like come along. I have some clothes and like shoes that I wanna bring to Plato's closet, but I hate going to Plato's closet. The lines are just incredibly long and they like barely take any of my stuff and all my stuff is so cute. I'm just gonna put a little bit of makeup on today. Guys, I'm so impressed with how my skin is doing. Like, I usually get really bad hormonal acne around, like, on my period. And I don't know if it's this, or I was also taking Elix, which, if you don't know, it's like Chinese medicine, like herbs for hormone imbalances. So it balances your hormones and stuff. So it could be that. I will say that I was getting, like, a little bit of cramping but i feel like it's definitely not as bad as it was like months prior i definitely feel like we're getting somewhere with that um so yeah, i'm excited to keep using it and seeing what else it does it's 122 dollars for three months but anything about like if it's gonna help me with how i feel it's so worth it because how you feel and your health at the end of the day i feel like is the most important part but honestly, like, it's not even that much for what it is, you know? Like, I definitely would spend more on Starbucks <laughs> in the three months than I would <laughs> on that, so. Also, another thing that I've been doing is buying organic. And 
I used to think that people buying organic was just like they're just like crunchy people and they don't like I don't I didn't really see the point but I saw this post and it was like how even just buying like half of your things organic can balance your hormones like by like half or like something like that like it improves your hormones by like half or something and I was like wait like all the pesticides I didn't even think of that were like totally messing up my hormones and making me absolutely miserable because I can deal with PMS you know it's not fun but I was getting I think estrogen dominance and I was getting really bad ovulation pain and feeling so nauseous that I thought I was gonna vomit when my estrogen would start to rise again like after my period so yeah I was like okay something's going on here and I don't know what why but I'm like Mackenzie like maybe it's not you it's your country and your food <clears throat> aka the United States because they allow like crap to be in our food so I've been buying as much organic stuff as I possibly can and honestly like again I will splurge on health and wellness if it's gonna make me feel better and I definitely think that my hormones are like actually like chilling out like I did not get any ovulation pain this month which was weird and I was like wait did I even ovulate but like I for sure did um and honestly it's not, hasn't even been that expensive because I go to Trader Joe's and I feel like the organic stuff is pretty good price so yeah I 100% want to partner with Elix so bad because I just want to tell everybody to use it and that it's worth it. I think I'm gonna do some red light therapy from my back and edit. And I really need to read, guys. I've been slacking so bad. Okay, here's the makeup for today. Just something super light. Like I food. swear, it's been less than like 10 minutes and we already have our food and like no, appetizer, like, drink. It took like 5 minutes. No, it's like 10 minutes. Like but five. still, that's crazy. 